Breaking news coming in. NCP passes resolution to disqualify nine uh, rebel MLAs. Pankaj Upadhyay is joining us for the latest. Pankaj, throwing straight across to you for all the action coming in from Mumbai on back of this Maharashtra quake. Now the latest that we're hearing is that NCP has passed a resolution to disqualify nine rebel MLAs. Yes, Shati, action by the hour. And now the latest coming in that the disciplinary committee of the NCP has passed a resolution to disqualify nine MLAs who had taken oath yesterday, which includes the current DCM Ajit Pawar. Now the disciplinary committee maintains that this entire operation was done in a very secretive fashion. And the president of the party, Sharat Pawar, was not kept in the loop of the things. He had no go-ahead from the party. And that is the reason why action needs to be taken against these nine MLAs. Because these people, these MLAs, including Ajit Pawar, Chagan Bhujbal, have indulged in anti-party activities. At the same time, at around 5 p.m. today, Ajit Pawar will hold a press conference in Sayadri Guest House, where he, he will reveal his further plans. Importantly and interestingly, today at 11 a.m., he had a meeting with all his party loyalists. That meeting lasted for one and a half hours. After that, an NCP leader, uh, Ajit Pawar, along with other party loyalists, went straight to Devinder Farnavis's residence, and there too, they had an hour long meeting. And now, Ajit Pawar is going to come out and have a press conference. Party insiders say that they're now going to reveal the various policies and programs that they are going to have with Farnavish and Shinde Alliance. They are perhaps going to reveal how they are going to prepare for the upcoming assembly polls and the most important Lok Sabha polls as well. So it's going to be very interesting to see because these developments are going to take place at a time where Sharad Pawar is already indulging in show of strength and Sharad Pawar loyalists clearly maintain that the story is far from over and that within next 48 hours, many people who have joined the Ajit Pawar camp will return to the senior Pawar fold. So while on the surface... Interesting one to watch out for. Only time is NCP, going to tell. So it's going to be a power pack next 48 hours. Pankaj, continue to be out there. We're getting more breaking news coming in. Sharad Pawar has torn into Praful Patel, called him lucky. Sharad Pawar says Praful Patel got everything on a platter. He says Praful filed nomination and got into Rajya Sabha as well. Clearly, Pankaj, Sharad Pawar feels betrayed by Praful Patel. Well, the statements definitely indicate so when Sharad Pawar says that uh, Praful Patel was lucky enough. Yes. The fact remains, Praful Patel was and is one of the loyalists, a long-time loyalist of Sharad Pawar and he was the one who was handling all the party activities for the NCP in Delhi. But not just Praful Patel, another party loyalist, another Sharad Pawar loyalist, Dilip Palse Patel, he's also, joined, he's also sworn in and that has also shocked many people. At the same time, Chagan Bhujbal, senior NCP leader, he's also, uh, uh, he's also a, part of, a part of the cabinet now. Now, Sunit Tatkere, who's a Lok Sabha member, his daughter uh, has, has also been sworn in. So there, there are many surprises that we've seen yesterday. So it is very difficult to make a statement right now as to why the former loyalists, those people who are consider, considered to be close confidants of senior Pawar, have someone, suddenly changed, changed their goalposts and now aligning with Ajit Pawar. And here the interesting thing comes, Chaiti. Yeah. Many of the party insiders say, don't talk about the statements that are being made by Sharad Tawar and Ajit Pawar. The fact remains, this was not an overnight decision. The decision was not taken in haste. This oh, was absolutely. coming for many weeks now. And thorough deliberations took place between NCP leaders and Devendra Fandavis, who was the main coordinator of what has happened now. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Continue to be with us right there. Day after, Ajit Pawar pulled a Maha surprise and took oath as the new Deputy Chief Minister of Maharashtra. The war has intensified in the NCP with Pawar versus Pawar escalating. NCP Chief Sharad Pawar is um, in Karat town where he visited the memorial of his mentor and state's first chief minister with Jashwant Rao Chava. After which Pawar in his first public meeting with his nephew Ajit Pawar uh, hid out at the BJP toppling governments and creating a division based on religious lines. Pawar vowed to unite Maharashtra against these divisive forces. 